Hey guys, this is my 2021 Honda Pilot. Uh, barely 1000 miles on it and one night in street parking resulted with this. The mirror is completely broken and it's hanging by the wire there. Hope you can see it. Everything is shattered as you can see. And then from the bottom, it's all gone. So I checked with the Honda dealers. They said uh, it's gonna cost me $500 for the part and then 300 for labor. The problem is this guy is on national back order with no ETA. So I pretty much checked with every single dealer and online Honda stores uh, for the part and everyone said the same uh, exact reason. It's on back order with no ETA. So today I'm just gonna go ahead and remove this part. At least I can drive the car. I don't want the mirror to be like that, scratching my uh, paint. So today we're gonna see how to get this mirror out. Okay, let's do that. So to access the mirror, gotta remove this guy. And to remove this guy, gotta remove this door panel. And the door panel, uh, there's a screw there, gotta remove that. And then there are two more screws inside that thing. Gotta remove that. So let's see if I can get another camera to record this. There it is, it just came out. Yeah, this is really loose. Well, okay, two. Okay, three. Okay, so we remove two screws from there, one from here, and now we should be able to pry this door panel open. Okay. Okay, let's pry this guy out. Okay, so there is the door, it's hanging by the wire, and hopefully you can see it, leave it, will it hang on its own, I think it will, okay, I'm just going to let it hang like that, and then remove this guy, so, so this should also come like that, and that's the pin. It's gonna go hold there. Okay. So I guess we just need to remove these three nuts and that should get our mirror free. Okay, so now let's remove the wire. So the wire that goes to the mirror is that which is plugged here. So we gotta remove that. So if you press this tab and pull this guy, it should come out. So it's kind of hard to record and do everything, so let me see. Almost there. Okay, there it is. Okay. So now the last step is to remove these three nuts. Let me go find something to get this guy out. Okay. So 10 mm is the one that fits. Okay. Just 
hold the mirror so the mirror doesn't fall down. Okay, hopefully you can see. This is how it looks without the mirror. Okay. I guess we need this part when the new mirror comes because that needs to go in. Okay, now we just do the reverse, put everything back until I can find a replacement mirror. So this one goes first. Okay, here's a pro tip. So before you put your door panel back, see how much gap here, you see it here. So you need to start from the top and this part of the door should sit on top like that. So hopefully I can show this in video. Just like that and then and then we go on that side and then make sure that these two holes are aligning and it's aligning and just push it what are you doing here Money? and look how it is now okay and then i'm going to just going to put the screw back this guy is right here i know it's tiring okay okay Close the door, it's locking, it's unlocking, and hopefully, and let me start the car. And that's working too. Okay. So here is how it looks without the mirror. So hopefully I can shop one and find a mirror. Until then, this is how it's gonna look like. All right, thanks.